grind, guys. another video today we're out here with my boy joshua from Wanda. as y'all can see we're out on his boat we're out on my boy joshua's boat and uh we're out here at the Averhoff, man the freaking water has gotten so damn low like all these trees that y'all are seeing are supposed to be underwater like if if the water level was it was where it's supposed to be at you'd barely be able to see the top of those trees Oh, the water's gotten super damn low and then as y'all can tell just like in crystal man like the the water it has that green color but it's just because all the trees and, and the grass and all that stuff that's in the water is dying off already. Um, but I still can't find my chesty, guys. I I still can't find it. I don't know where the hell I left it. Um, I've checked my car. I've checked Monica's car. I've checked the freaking rivers. I, I can't freaking find it. So I still got y'all on that clamp. And uh, we'll probably just put you down and pick y'all up whenever I catch a fish or something. I'm pretty sure this spot right here was badass, bro, when it had the water drop. Fucking deep and wide as fuck. Cause the water's supposed to be on top of that right there. All right, guys, we've been out for about two hours now, and uh, we're barely starting to get bites. I switched it up. I I'm using the the trench hug with uh with that fluorescent bead and a 3 16th ounce weight with a little six cents uh peg on there and uh so far i've gotten two bites or three bites if you include the bluegill but those those dudes are just annoying man um got one little guy and i set the hook on him didn't set it hard enough i he spit it out and then right now it's getting bit hard hard and I, when i set the hook on it uh, i just yanked it right out of his mouth but they kept the trench hog should have given it more time to eat it. Decided to turn on the GoPro now that we're starting to get some bites. Well, let's see if we can just hook into one. See him running with it? <laughs> third what is that the third damn fish already man they, they take off running with it they have it they bite it bite it bite it take off with it set the hook on them and they just spit it out i got a paddle tail guggen squad saucy swimmer with an underspin uh hook on it and they weren't biting that like there's another bite right there man oh yeah yeah It's a nice one. Fat, bro. Fat. Oh, shit. Yeah, they're eating. Crawfish right there, boy. Crawfish right down. Well, it's only the antenna sticking out. I think he's 14. Huh? He's got a little measure until 14. Yeah, you like bass, boy? Hell uh, yeah, I fry him up. Yeah? I don't remember his much. Fish. Check it out guys Little bass, little guy Finally took, look at his lip though And I did, he's been caught before Because I didn't do this I don't, I'm sure y'all saw me take the hook out of right here But look at his lip right there He's been caught a couple times and it's ripped But look at the belly on this dude And uh, I don't know how good y'all can see it But he has some antennas You got one? He's getting bit right he has uh, crawfish antenna sticking out his throat too. Uh, we're gonna. I, I doubt. I don't think he's quite 14 just yet. But we're gonna measure him real quick. See what he. See what he fucking comes out. Yeah. 
All right, guys, about 13 and a quarter, so we're gonna go ahead and release him. Straight down. <laughs> All right, let's uh, fix up this um, brush hog real quick, and we'll get right back up. Got him. Yeah. Got him. Another little guy. Well, he's not that bad. Did he swallow it? Check it out, guys. Fish number two. I'm gonna get blood all over you, bro. Fuck. I had a bite too. Huh? I had a bite right now. No shit? Yeah, I just. Wait too long, I set the hook. I did, man. I did hook him. Oh, you hooked him pretty good? Yeah, I got him in the throat. I was, oh damn. Yeah, you good, you good, bro. You good. You good, bro. You good. I almost dropped my damn rod in the water, guys. But, uh, check it out. <laughs> He's bleeding. So, we're going to get a release on him. See if we can get another one. My bad, guys. GoPro battery died on me. So, I couldn't get the release for y'all. But, this is what we caught him on. We're using the, the Guggen Squad, mm, the Bandito Bug. If I'm correct, I believe it's called uh, Green Pumpkin Purple. Something like that. Purple on one side. Or no, it might be Watermelon Purple. Because that's a watermelon on one side and purple on the other. I'm fishing it with the watermelon down and the purple side up. Just because that's how I saw it stay. Um, who was it? I think it was uh, Lunkers TV that I saw him fishing it like this. So that's why I said, screw it, I'm going to fish it like that too. But uh, let's get back out and see if we can get another one. Alright guys. My boy Josh will find this his first fish of the day. Good little JD special, bro. <laughs> My boy got him a JD special. <laughs> Hell yeah. That's three fish for the day, guys. Hopefully we can get some more bites. Some bigger fish. Upgrade them. We'll just see what the day see what the day gives us. What's up, bro? Little best of taking it. Hell yeah. To my wife. <laughs> Check it out, guys. That was not bad either, bro. Yeah. Joshua hooked up to the second fish of the day. Now we're tied at two fish. Oh, she swallowed that second he swallowed it. Yeah. You need the pliers? Yeah. Right, boy. <laughs> All right, guys. GoPro died on me. Uh, Joshua just released his second fish. That makes us tied for the day, two and two. Both about pound, pound and a half first. And uh, like I was saying, man, it's, it's about noon. Getting sweaty, getting hot. This battery is only at 50%, so it is, I'm not really going to turn it on that much unless we get a fish. So I'll see you on the next one. Peace. Special? On the JD special. Check it out. Bro, like as soon as I turned off the GoPro, he, he went and caught another one. The same as the other one. It swallowed it too? They're just, they're inhaling this freaking thing. All right, let me put, put y'all down real quick. It's, it's, it's happening as soon as as soon as it hits the water, they're biting it, right. and you don't you don't feel it until they finally start to move around. I just do it like I just don't see them move the, when they move the line at all. Yeah. 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 Oh, that was not bad, bro. Oh, dude, monster, bro. Dude, and if it was biting like less, oh, it was biting less than the small ones, we. Really. It was it's biting like lighter than the small yeah, ones. Bro. <laughs> oh, look, what does he have right there? Check that out. Oh shit. 
That's a good one. That's a good one right there, bro. This is my biggest Avery Hoff bass right here. Or right, we'll have to weigh them. We'll have to weigh them. I got my yeah. skill. We're going to weigh them. I caught a bass out here uh, sometime last year. I can't remember exactly what time of year it was. But I, I believe that one weighed two and a half pounds. I'll have to go back on my videos. But I think this guy got good. Did he? <laughs> Did he, no, he didn't, he didn't swallow it, guys. I don't know if you can tell. He didn't really swallow it. But it's like it's hooked all the way to hell back there. So let's see if I can get him out, get it out without hurting it too much. I'm gonna go through the, the gills. Oh, he, he wasn't pulling or anything. Got gotcha. you. It was biting lighter than the freaking than the than the smaller ones were. Oh, yeah. She, she. Yeah, yeah, let's pop him on the scale real quick. <laughs> oh, he didn't bite over there, bro. He bit basically right oh, here in yeah. the middle. Yeah. All right, got him on the scale. Turn it on. Turn it on. Please tell me this. This thing. Oh, yeah, yeah, bro. Scale's on, zeroed out. Let's weigh him out. 2.7, bro. It's not a bad one right here. Check it out, guys. 2.7 pounds. She. Yeah, you want to keep them? Nice one, bro. Hell yeah, we're going to be keeping this one today, guys. All right, guys. About 1.15 in the afternoon. We're going to go ahead and just call it a day. It's hot as hell. Bite slowed down. We're somewhat satisfied with the fish we got. So, uh, yeah. again, huge shout out to my boy Joshua from Moanda for, for taking me out on his boat out here at the Averhoff. Uh We'll see if we can link up again and maybe do a video at the Boeington or something. We'll see where, where the road takes us later on. But until then, guys, peace. Catch you on the next one.